Alright, welcome back everyone to episode 5 of Dishonored. Here we go once more. Uh, yeah, I did I did look and this game did came out in like 2012, so uh, not quite 2016 as I thought before. It's been a day or two. But I believe I know I can play this game again. So I looked and there was like one short game and then the Dishonored 2 of course. So yeah I'm gonna take a look at how to play it in order. I, had, I did not expect this game to be so much fun as it is. I have to get into this whole stuff again. I can use that. Oh, yeah, I can use it. And there are some more booms. Great. Yeah, so yeah, uh, as I said, did not expect this game to be quite interesting. From the start, I was like, nah. No need for this. Then I played it and I was like, oh, you know what? This is pretty cool. What's this? And being it that it came out in 2012, I'm just like, yep. I did uh, also look and it, it seems like uh, wait, what do I need to do? Talk to the animal. It seems like I can play Black Ops uh, Open Beta because uh, I have the... Uh... How the fuck do I get there? I got Xbox Game Pass Ultimate. <laughs> Their fate rests on your effort, on the strength of your hands, and of your heart. So yeah, tomorrow I might play Xbox, I mean, the Black Ops 6 open beta. They stood in a circle oh, no. of candles, and cut their hands to form their alliance. The blood hissed as it touched the flames. I feel like inside this tower has to be the way to go. It struggles so much with going up. Or maybe whatever that is. But let's try this tower first. Nothing, eh? I don't know. I, I, I do like the puzzle type games. It always makes me wonder what to do. Yeah, I'm not going up there. I'm probably gonna see what's up there. The conspirators have found a safe home here. They take great care that they are followed. Yeah, it's definitely in this... Whatever this is. I don't think I can do anything. I guess I will climb this tower then. Will I?
does not look like it lets me climb this tower. Come on, bro. I suppose not. Uh, well, I checked the other side. I don't think I know how to get there. Yeah, so for now I'll just continue then. Such a shame. Where the fuck is this guy, bro? Hello. There are important things we Hello, Corvo. I expect Martin will be joining us shortly. I hate to start your day with such a strange matter, but the servants heard something last night. Moving through the storm drains beneath the building. Most likely a weeper, the poor bastard. There's no hope for them once the plague gets that far along. Nothing more than a shuffling corpse full of sickness and insects, if you ask me. I'd appreciate you investigating. Just to be sure it's not a nosy guardsman that's getting too close. Here's a key to the hatches. I send a servant down there, but they die of fear on the spot, I'm afraid. Maybe Piero can concoct some sort of sleep poison for your crossbow if you want to go that route. Okay, right, cool. I already got the sleep poison, so... Is it equipped? It is equipped. Maybe that's how I get it. Okay, what's this? Get in and out, I suppose. This is where I was just a second ago. So those are the weepers, the infected people. Wait, was that it? That's it. There was a rune right here and the heart didn't do anything? How many runes do I have? Cost five runes. Jeez. Yeah, I don't think that slowing time is my thing. The swarm would be nice. I don't see that doing anything. Maybe the shattering of the doors might be cool, but more than that, it's no. Hmm. <laughs>
Yes, I'll keep on and going. Okay, well, that's that then. Quick and easy little side quest. Oh, the door. You went down there in the sewers? I thought I heard a weeper in there earlier. You're probably the bravest man I've ever met. Overseer Martin has arrived. He's with Admiral Havelock now. They want to talk to you. I know the Golden Cat. Not as a patron, mind you. Person weepers. Roaming all over the city. For them, I... Yo. Oh, my friend. Do you need ammunition or weaponry? Would you like me to craft something for you? Yes. I got a lot of coins. Let me replenish that. How many of these do I have? Oh, I have plenty. Upgrades, people. It's all about the upgrades. Guess I'll do that. This is nice. I don't know much about the mask optics. That's cool. I don't really use my weapons all too well, I suppose. Bone charms. Slightly more mana. Hmm, I need some more of these bone charms, the good ones at least, because I'm not seeing any, you know, good stuff. I guess I'll use these ones. Yeah, okay, well. Corvo, I trust you remember Martin, an overseer before and perhaps again someday soon. I owe you thanks for my rescue. Indeed. You've given us a glimmer of hope, Corbin. Because we've gotten what we wanted from Campbell's journey. You've done it. We know where Emily Caldwood is being held. The Golden Cat, of all places. A bathhouse for aristocrats. Little better than a cursed brothel. But there's an unfortunate twist. It appears that Pendleton's own kinsmen stand in our way. The twins, Morgan and Custis. Not only are they controlling Emily, but they have the controlling parliamentary votes we so desperately need. Yes, the Pendletons have to die. But most importantly, Emily must be brought here safely so we can protect her until the Lord Regent and his entourage have been dealt with. There's no we, Pendleton it's just waiting me. On the dock. He's asked to brief you personally. I think it's best. Corvo, a moment if I may. Yeah, of course. Corvo, I've asked to speak to you myself. You see, I'm sending you to kill my older brothers, Morgan and Custis. They're horrible men. It's true, as you may have heard, cruel beyond words. Further, my brothers are close allies to the Lord Regent, and as long as they are in Parliament, we cannot gather the votes we'll need to stop the Lord Regent from further consolidating his power. These days, they're best known for exploiting their favor with him to cheat others out of their wealth. Let's just say that 
Not every family evicted in quarantine for having the plague actually has the plague. I warned my brothers in every way I could. I really did. But they never did listen to me. They'll be at the Golden Cat tonight at their usual revels. They'll be protected by the city watch, so it'll be dangerous. Now go. Please do it before I change my mind. No worries, my guy. So did the other guy also want to talk? Suppose not. I'll take you to the Golden Cat when you're ready. I've taken Lord Pendleton enough times, believe me. Let's go. Yeah. House of Pleasure. The loyalists believe that Emily is being held at the Golden Cat by the corrupt aristocrat Pennington brothers. These men are Lord Pennington's dis despised older brothers, twins. They are loyal to the tyrann tyrannical Lord Regent. Find Emily at the Golden Cat and eliminate Lords Custis and Morgan. Ben Bethelton. I'll get Perhaps you as I will. close as I can to the Golden Cat, Corvo. You'll have to go the rest of the way on your own. The entrance is near Holger Square. The main thing is to make sure that little girl, Emily, gets back all safe and sure. Them two Pendletons are there, so I'm guessing there'll be a lot of guards. Slackjaw might have some ideas on helping you get inside the cat. If he don't kill you. This here's his territory. He and his Bottle Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall Whiskey Factory. They sell the elixir that folks use to fight off the plague. I'll lay low, but keep an eye out for you and the little lady you bring him back. Good luck to you. I know Emily must mean a lot to you. She, she does indeed. Be careful going up the street, Corvo. A river hand I know pulled up alongside me last night and said there's one of those watchtowers on Clavering now. I guess you getting rid of Campbell shook up the Lord Regent. Slick jaw. So is this the same place or this it is the same place now, isn't it? Bone charms. Bone cat distillery. I guess I'll go that way. But this time it's not at night time. Your effect your actions affect the city. A high number of death result in a more rats and weepers. Different uh, reactions from your allies and dark darker final outcomes. What the fuck's that? What the hell? I guess they try to escape. Watchtower?
I think it may be my best interest to look and see if I can disable that. Can reach that shit. There's no other people. You, you know what? I cannot be bothered by that shit, bro. Attention, Dunwall citizens. Thaddeus Campbell, formerly High Overseer, is no longer a citizen of Dunwall. He now bears the Heretics brand, and by one of Who the, the fuck are you? Anything in your pocket for a poor working man? It is now well, a pal. minor criminal offense to offer this man aid or help. You want a slack jaws man? This time of what you want crisis, with me? I ain't got nothing. What you bothering me for? Until a new no worries, bro. Possible. What? So. I see it. he doesn't look like a soldier to me. Hmm. Let's go see what's up then. Hey, you're just the man I was looking for. Slackjaw's wanting to talk to you. What a mess, huh? Whole town's gone to trash. I was thinking about, wasn't this the distillery I fucked up last time? It is. That him? Yeah, he's the one. If you're looking for Slackjaw, he's in the distillery. Go on. Slackjaw's inside. What's up there? Got anything to smoke or eat? Huh. Well, perhaps it's inside. I didn't mean to disrupt the dialogue of the brother main. It's not inside. Okay. There's something inside, alright. I don't think they're gonna last much longer in there. No. That's what they get for taking free swigs from the steel. That tainted elixir is bad. God damn it. They're infected people. I see. Slackjaw be waiting for you. Yeah, they got so much stuff. Easy, easy. You just need a bit. Ain't you heard? Slackjaw keeps the good stuff for himself. The rest of us get one part elixir, three parts water now. Oh, that's just to make the swallow lose. Well, I ain't taking no chances on getting the plague. Drink till you drop, that's fine. Yeah, oh. Don't think there's anything of special interest in here. What's up, bro? He is a villain if I judge your looks alright. A villain I might have some work for. Somebody put plague in the brew tank. Half my men are weepers. Trapped three of them in the distillery. Rest are wandering in the street. Since it's so, and I find myself short of able bodies, I may have a point of interest for you, see? Way I figure it, there ain't nobody worth killing around here except those two Pendletons over at the Golden Cat. I'm right, ain't I? See, 
slash your nose. Them boys are twins. Rich, mean, and weird. Worse than most of their ilk. They've been laying low there a while, not sure why. There's a lot of security at the Golden Cap tonight, though. Special guests and the like. But you're gonna walk in there, dress like that, and kill the Pendleton brothers? Maybe I got a better way to take care of them, too. If you're doing something for me first, understand. Someone, I don't know who, is killing my men, taking my territory, stealing my goods. Might be a fellow name of Galvani. I sent my best man to investigate, but he went missing and... Well, now I need someone to find what happened to him. Go to this Galvani's place. He lives nearby off Clavering Boulevard. You do that for me and I'll get your better way into the Golden Cat. Okay, okay. Is uh, the key? So it's all connected, right? I poison these motherfuckers. Now I uh, work for these motherfuckers. Well, not for, but with. He wants me to find out. Sure, I'll find out. This was I in here before? No, but there's also nothing. Oh, there. Such an idiot. I swear the key was in here, right? Uh, I was right there the first time. I suppose it may be in here now. That's how I get out. Well, I've got the key now. Oh, whatever. Killing rats give you some adrenaline. I know. Shit about some adrenaline. Hey, bro, why the fuck you swinging at me for? Bro, what the fuck is going on? Son of a bitch, now I have need... I need to heal again. Well, it's a good thing I cannot get affected. Why the fuck are there more people? Oh, 
Yeah, there's no point in staying in here. Hey, blow off, chopper. Fuck you guys. Don't eat river crust. It'll make you sick as a bucket. What's that? Motherfucking noise, bro. Why the fuck? What the fuck is going on, bro? Man, this combat system is fucking atrocious. What is going on out here, bro? I heard s stuff and things, but I was like, okay, yeah, sure, whatever. I need to find this motherfucking bone charm. Man, the combat system is fucking trash. I just wanted to see what's up and all of a sudden I get ambushed. That's so fucking annoying. Want to look at some of the things I've found? Good prices, I swear. Yeah, yeah, show me. One of those, less magnification. Guess I'll purchase that. Good stuff, bro. And this thing? All dealers apartment key need. Come on. You swing your sword slightly faster. I suppose I will do. Yes, it's time to go to to your fun. I I I really hate this mechanic, these game mechanics, bro. I was just like, okay, let's go there. Motherfucker doesn't fucking jump. That was the fucking point then. If he didn't catch that shit now, I would be pissed. Even more so. So this is like the main game city. Uh, let's just take the easy way. No, oh, it's on the ground.
Such a fucking waste. Oh, I want to do this. Son of a bitch. Ah. This game sure is annoying. way for upstairs okay well uh, if you haven't noticed from the last time people spawn in when you get there so right now there's no one around and all of a sudden there's people out here oh he's definitely dead think? i think he's dead right i know that i mean do we have suspects suspects what suspects we ain't gonna waste time solving who killed him personally i find I can use rodents now, right? Oh, yes. <laughs> ah, I shit bigger. What the fuck? Oh, what the fuck? What the what the fuck? Did did I miss something? Huh? Whoa. Allows control of animal targets for a short duration. If you read that, then it's like you take control of an animal and you scout the fuck out. Possession is very powerful, allowing you to merge physically with an animal such as a fish or a cat. For a limited reason, you have an unobstructed path to your target. The power is useful for stealth, enabling you to hide in small places or more thorough spaces normally too small for you, like water filled. Drain is by ventilation ducts. Enemies will try to stomp you if you are if you are possessing or while possessing a hound you can sprint fast at level two. You can possess humans as well. Your control of human is limited, so combat or fast movement is 
are not possible. Possessing humans allows you to perform simple, uh, but or act like an arc pylon or wall of light. It will not harm you if you are falling. So it's just possession, right? Then why the fuck did I end appear over there? Hey, why the fuck did I appear over there? Man, the first time I played it was okay. Now it's starting to get a little less okay. So now I'm a fucking rat. Should we gather for whiskey and cigars tonight? Never doubt. Oh, so that just uses my stamina. I ain't no getting it back. But yeah, so that's that, right? Return to audiograph to the slugjaw guy. Sounds good to me, bro. Was there an exit over here? I don't know, I cannot remember. I will just... Very it along. <sighs> anyway, that's gonna be it for the, this episode. This game is okay. I hope that the next games are gonna be better. But for right now, I'm just like, ah, it's such a hit or a miss. Like, if you get used to the movement and the combat system, it's okay. But still, the combat is not really that great, though. But yeah, as long as it's stealth and you sneak around, it's a nice game. For a game that came out 12 years ago. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I'll see you next time. Right, bye.